The city of Madison says it is planning to replace tens of thousands of traffic signals. Madison Rios joins us now. In Madison, the city says this project will happen over the next span of the next five years. So when can drivers expect to see a change? Brandon, this project is expected to finish up, like you said, by 2028, and drivers will see these changes happen, happening gradually. This project is part of the Carbon Reduction Program, or CRP. 80% of the project will be federally funded, and then the other 20% of the project will come from municipal funding. According to one of the project leads, new signals will be coming to roughly 250 different intersections across Madison. These intersections will be what the city calls non-connecting highways, meaning intersections of roadways without a number designation. So what does this mean for you on the road? Well, it could decrease wait times at signals altogether. We will have a lot more flexibility with how we phase traffic signals. So, you know, for example, uh, you may have some left turn phases, uh, you know, say eastbound and westbound that may be timed the same. If there's more of a demand on say one approach versus the other, it would give more green time than for the one that has the highest demand. He adds, these traffic lights may have a more fluid and incandescent look to them versus some of the older lights having a more pixelated look. The goal for the newer signals is to increase the sustainability of the lights, leading to less maintenance and repairs overall.